Hi, I'm uh, Tim Kent, and this is Betsy, uh, my baby, which um, I've had since 1971, which is an awful long time. Now, Betsy started life in 1937 and was registered very, very early in January 1938 to a gentleman in South London, uh, a Mr. Pritcher, who owned it for quite a long time, and he moved out of the suburbs down to Lansing in, I think, the sort of early 1950s. Anyway, he uh, ran it for many, many years and kept a meticulous log of how many miles it had done each year. So we do know that the car has got a full history and we know exactly how far it's been. Well, I came across Betsy in a sort of Nissan hut up in Salvington Hill. I was working for a local builder at the time and uh, he wanted 200 quid for it. But I think, looking at my records, I only actually paid him 185 in the end. But she's been with me all those years and I've spent a little bit more than £185 on her in getting her back into shape. She's quite a famous girl, actually. She's been in several films, um, on the telly, and uh, photo shoots for various magazines. And, of course, most importantly, uh, here we are today for the local press. Now, under the bonnet of Betsy, we have a super two-litre, six-cylinder, um, naturally aspirated engine which keeps up with modern day traffic quite nicely so um, with all that power under the bonnet uh, and a good four speed gearbox she's good for motorway and long distance driving which obviously was the original design of the vehicle back in the 30s built for the German roads and the long sort of pre-autobahn and of course, here are the famous kidney grills of the BMW that are still prominent in today's design, along with the propeller badge. Now, this is quite unusual because Fraser Nash, who were the importers, it is the only time BMW has ever allowed another name on the famous roundel. Something you don't see nowadays, and that is suicide doors. I think you can probably imagine why they're called suicide doors if you opened this at 70 miles an hour on the motorway. So that's the brief story of Betsy, my little girl. Had her since 1971 and I think I will be keeping it for quite a few years to come. And enjoy.